Hello, welcome to the 50th edition of the Truth Commission Special Report. We appreciate your company every Sunday evening. If you were to ask us what the most serious shortcomings were of the Truth Commission, we would have to say the lack of coverage of the conflict in KwaZulu-Natal. But this is about to be corrected. The Truth Commission is slowly shifting its emphasis to the only part of our country where the conflict has not ended. We report tonight on one of the towns in the KwaZulu-Natal Midlands that have been terrorized by the war between the ANC and the IFP for more than a decade now. We also tell you about the mysterious death of a dedicated young community worker in the province. And we move down south with a special report on the forgotten young comrades of the Cape Flats. We start in a town and a township with a rich irony and their names. The town is called Pretty River or Moirafir. The township is Brantville. The bulk of the testimony before the Truth Commission so far has been about the suppression of ordinary people by the former government security forces. But in KwaZulu-Natal, it has not been that simple. At least on the surface, this is seen as a war between supporters of the ANC and the Inkata Freedom Party. The political leadership of the IFP ordered their supporters not to take part in the Truth Commission process. That is why we did not hear the voice of a single IFP victim of the bitter conflict in Bruntville at the human rights violations hearings this week. 